Today I will review the new CA1 smartwatch from the famous Yinji brand. This is one of my favorite smartwatch brand and I have been personally wearing different models from this brand for the last 6 months like the C1, C2, N1 and the most recently Nothing 3 model. And I have been extremely happy with its performance. Now this new CA1 model comes with a massive 1.96 inch AMOLED display with a very high resolution of 410 by 502. It's got a strong titanium alloy frame that comes in two colors, black and military green. It's a IP68 waterproof certified watch. It's got the usual sports and health tracking and a very powerful 300 mAh battery that can easily last you for more than a week with regular usage. So guys, let's do a quick unboxing first and then we will test the performance of this new CA1 smartwatch from the Jinji brand. So keep watching guys. All right, friends, so now let's do the unboxing uh, of this Jinji CA1 uh, smartwatch. It comes in this uh, white box. You've got the image here, some of the features mentioned here, and it's basically a sleeve. So you take sleeve out, and uh, you get the box. Let's open it, and then you get uh, the smartwatch. All right, so let's uh, open this. All right, so we'll come back to this in a while. Um, let's check out the other contents in the box. So let's take this out. So what you get is uh, the user manual. You've got instructions in different languages. And then you get uh, the cable to charge uh, the smartwatch. It's a, it's a very simple cable. Uh, you connect this uh, with the power source and the other end connects at the back of the smartwatch. So that's it guys. So this is all we get inside the box. Uh, now let's have a closer look at this uh, smartwatch, the CA1 from Jinji. Now uh, it comes in two colors as I said earlier. It comes in um, black and military green. This is the military green uh, color. Um, let's open it. It's a very nice uh, liquid silicone strap that comes on it and you can obviously change this if you want. Um, and let's take off this protective plastic. There you go. Again, this is a 1.96 inch AMOLED display with the curved ends. You can see it's, uh, it's curvy at the end. Um, now the weight is quite uh, nice. It's not uh, very heavy or uh, not light. Um, now this is a very strong titanium alloy frame and uh, in terms of the first impression uh, looks quite nice. It's a bit bendy the, the structure. It's not uh, straight so it would probably sit nicely on your wrist. It's a nice color. Now in terms of the body as I said it's 1.96 inch AMOLED uh, display. Um, you've got one button here as well as a dial and then you've got obviously the built-in speakers on this side and the built-in mic on the other side. Um, now looking at the back this is the sensor right in the middle and then this is the port to connect the charging cable. So you simply need to connect this with the power source and the other end uh, connects with the, the back end here like this. Uh, Alright, so let's uh, switch it on and then we start testing the different functions and features of this uh, Jinji CA1 smartwatch. Keep watching guys. Alright, so now let's switch it on. Now one really good thing about this watch and most of the Jinji watches is that you know it takes probably a second or two for the watch to start which is really good you know it tells you how fast the processor in this watch is uh, so we've switched this on and this is how it looks it looks very very nice uh, again because it's an AMOLED screen the clarity is amazing uh, just like the previous model the one I tested was uh, nothing 3 uh, that was the AMOLED uh, screen as well and that's why you know the clarity of the screen is amazing on these uh, on these new uh, AMOLED screens um, looks very very nice I'm, I'm quite impressed with the size of the screen here you know it looks very nice it's quite decent. Um, now this is uh, the main uh, watch 
face now obviously you long press this and uh, you can go and change it if you want you've got quite a few uh, different uh, watch faces available on this screen here or you can in fact go and uh, go to the app which is connected with your mobile and uh, you can download many more there i think more than 100 uh, different uh, uh, variety of uh, watch faces available um, and you can download as many as you want uh, so quite a few uh, nice ones on uh, uh, on the watch available um, now let me give you a very quick uh, tour of the different options now it's very similar to the previous uh, Jinji models i've tested it's uh, the 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 same uh, operating system um, so if you swipe it down you get to see uh, some of the shortcut um, uh, settings so you've got the brightness you've got the night mode the ringer uh, making calls and a shortcut settings option here uh, swipe down uh, you get to see all the different messages that you've been receiving uh, because this watch has a message notification uh, system as well so whenever you get a message either on the sms or on the whatsapp you would directly get the notification on the screen here uh, now if you swipe it to the left you get to see some of the activity uh, tracker um, then you also see the sleep monitor uh, beats per minute heart rate this is the weather um, the, you can operate the music on your mobile through this watch as well and you can add a few more widgets there uh, now if you swipe it to the right then you get to see all the different um, uh, settings available on this phone um, so for example if you go right to the top you've got the uh, settings on the telephone so you can make calls as well this is a bluetooth calling uh, a smartwatch you can make calls you've got a built-in microphone here and a built-in speaker on this side so you can actually make calls um, and then you obviously have the voice assistant on this you've got a few activity uh, data and the trackers you've got the heart rate oxygen level sleep monitor workout monitor and the records uh, you've got the messages you've got the weather because it's connected with my mobile already you can go and check out the weather as well uh, so you've got all the, the the standard stuff games now this one comes with four games if you remember the previous model had only one game but this one comes with four games so so that's quite nice so for example you can go to one of the games and uh, you can play the games now the screen size is quite big so you you know it's it's quite easy and comfortable to play games on this i don't know how many of you would actually play games on a smartwatch but if you want to you have option of uh, four games so these are um, you know all the different uh, settings on this uh, smartwatch now this smartwatch is uh, is ip68 waterproof rated and uh, we've uh, put this uh, to test uh, just a while back uh, put this uh, underwater and uh, and the good thing is it actually worked even uh, underwater it was working so so that's quite nice and decent now let me give you a quick uh, view of the mobile app that uh, you connect this smartwatch with all right, so this is the mobile app. Um, it's called Onwear Pro. Uh, this is the standard application that uh, most of the Jinji watches use. Um, you simply need to go and download this. Uh, this is available on both iPhone as well as uh, Android mobiles and other uh, platforms as well. So download, open it, and then simply go to your Bluetooth and connect the watch uh, with your uh, iPhone. As soon as you do that, you get this page. This is a landing page. You have uh, some of the activities here. You've got the weather on top. Um, you've got activity status exercise status and some of the other details and then you click on this exercise this is basically uh, gives you a view of your exercises uh, over uh, the last uh, 24 hours or so and uh, for example if you're running it will tell you you know you've uh, ran from point a to b and this is the distance you've covered and the time you've taken and the, the calories that were burned and then on the right side this is where you have all the different settings available uh, you've got some medals as well you can change the settings you can change settings on the notification or the messages you get you can set up some reminders as well so quite a few of the settings available here um, and this is also where you actually go and uh, download more uh, watch faces um, so this is called the mall and then you've got uh, the ones that you've already downloaded and then you've got different sections within this area so you've got the newest ones custom dial simple mechanical digital simple digital data pointers classics there's so many different categories of the watch faces and uh, and if you click on uh, any of those sections then you get to see all the different watch faces available within that category and then you simply need to click on this and um, you know it starts uh, downloading it on your uh, smartwatch so for example if you click this and we sync confirm 
and then you would get a notification on the watch face um, it tells you uh, that the synchronization has started and then you get a timer as well there you go so it's a very simple process uh, so that's uh, that's the application so you get quite a few of the other um, options available on the app as well uh, so so that's it guys so this was a very quick review of uh, this Jinji CA1 uh, smartwatch model this is the latest one from the Jinji brand um, this one comes with 1.96 AMOLED screen which is amazing um, and uh, all in all another very very nice uh, device from uh, from this brand and as I said earlier I've used almost all of their different models launched in the past and I am a big fan in fact as I said earlier I'm actually using this uh, myself and this is the nothing three model that I tested some time back um, and I've been using this before this I was using nothing one C1 C2 different models that I've been testing on my channel I actually use them myself uh, which is and and the overall performance has been amazing on these smart watches as you can see um, this is also AMOLED and the clarity is amazing on these uh, these new models models.